I built this Shopwork dust collector hybrid about a year ago and since then it's been working really really well. It looks a bit deranged because its brains are currently upstairs in the office for an upgrade and I will add some I think really cool stuff to this. But today I'm just gonna add this Y adapter so that I'll be able to attach two hoses simultaneously. Now this is quite a complex and curvy shape so a CNC router would be perfect for carving this. But I once thought, well, what am I gonna do with one of these laughable little CNC toy engravers? <laughs> and that's why I don't have one. But luckily there's still nothing you can do with a CNC that you can't do without. So I'm just gonna stick my paper template down to a piece of 18mm spruce plywood using a bit of glue stick. Then I drilled out the ray die on the drill press. Next I cut out the rest with the jigsaw. I'm holding it upside down so I can actually see where I'm cutting. I improvised a pin router setup on my router table. And with a piece of Baltic birch plywood screwed to the template, I first talked out most of the material by just following along the template. Then I removed the pin and sanded down the wooden disc a little bit. After reinstalling it I lowered my router bit a couple of millimeters and made my next cut. And I took out the pin, sanded it down, reinstalled it, lowered the bit and made my cut. Then I took out the pin, sanded it down and so on and so on. The smaller the disc, the wider will be the trench that the router bit cuts. And because I lower the router bit each time, this creates a step pattern. I coordinated this in a way that it will approximate kind of a half circle-ish profile. And now I have to smooth it out somehow. And for that I'm going to use my little homemade belt sander attachment on my angle grinder. I glued the pieces together temporarily and you can probably see that they are not precisely symmetrical, but nothing the sander couldn't fix.
I have to enlarge this hole a little bit to make it fit over the inlet pipe of the cyclone. Now I do of course need a blast gate, but that's gonna be the topic of another video.